Hi, I'm Ola and welcome to a new segment of mine called the Fortin Days Guitar Challenge. To be quite honest, I think a lot of us players out there feel that we aren't practicing enough guitar or uh, even struggle to find time or motivation to improve. The only time I even play guitar nowadays is either when I tour or when I'm making a video. I barely play guitar any other time, so it has become some sort of tool for me just to complete my work, rather like when I was young, I played because I wanted to. And I feel there's a lot of things I could personally improve with my playing, and that my playing is uh, rather limited. But I want that to change. I want to get back into a good habit of constantly practicing on something cool. So that's why I decided to start this series of videos. So the idea with the Fortin Days Challenge video is that I present to you a challenge. It could be a technique, a specific lick from a song or whatever that both you and I would practice for maybe 10 to 15 minutes or 30 minutes a day for 14 days. Then after 14 days, I will present a video of my progress and urge you guys to upload yours with a tag so I can check it out. And then I present another lick or challenge for the coming 14 days and so on and so on. So the idea is just to create a, a goal that we all follow. And I think it might be easier to do if we all do it together. Or uh, maybe, it's a, maybe it's a shitty idea that I will abandon in, after two videos, I don't know. But let's just see where we end up. I think if we keep it up, it will probably help us all to become a little better players. I don't know, maybe. So for this time, I just decided to take this alternate picking lick. And I've always had a hard time getting alternate picking right. So I think it's because of my weird picking technique. So I made this little segment just to start off. This guitar is tuned to E standard, uh, just for the simplicity. So we have E, B, G, D, A, and E. And here's the lick played at 70 beats per minute. Listen to that. Pretty straightforward. Okay, let's turn up to 100 maybe. See if I can do it there. So it's all 16th notes and strict alternate picking. So I start with the downstroke. Then just down, up, down, up, down, up, okay? Okay. Okay. That was 100, let's try it. Can I make it 140? 144. Shit. Okay, I'm, I'm finally kind of like feeling my limit here. But the idea is to start slow and try to make it as exact as you can. If you have a metronome, that is great. Use that to slowly build up speed. You start with a slow tempo and then you gradually increase the tempo. But personally, I would also try and practice it at killing speed in the sense of, you know, trying to play the segment over my ability, like this. <laughs> exactly, something like that. It's perfectly fine if it sounds shitty, just like it did for me there. The trick is to get your mind used to the idea of playing it fast. If you only practice and play at slow speeds, you're gonna become really great at playing that lick in a slow pace. We also need to practice at top speed. It's fine if the technique isn't there yet. It will come eventually when combining both slow and fast practicing. So uh, yeah, there you go. Is everything clear? Just make sure to practice a little every day for 14 days and we'll see where we end up in 14 days. Maybe I'll just cancel the show before 14 days, who knows? <laughs> Uh, I'm actually kind of excited. Let's just see what happens. And if you have any suggestions for upcoming challenges, please put them in the comments below. So yeah, okay. See you in 14 days. Have a good challenge or something. Huh. 170. Shit. Oh shit, okay. 190. Shit. Shit. 
Ah, uh, no. Okay, I have to practice for exactly 14 days. I'll see you in 14 days. It's gonna be awesome. <laughs> Talking to the microphone. Hey.